It's an understatement to say the Republican majority in the U.S. Senate will result in changes. Layton, the way agricultural policy will be made will certainly change. Experienced ag leaders will take control. Senator Thad Cochran's victory in Mississippi will put a friend of agriculture in a major leadership position. Cochran was elected to his seventh term. He will probably break Democrat John Stennis' record as the longest serving senator from Mississippi. Stennis served just over 41 years. With the Republican majority in the Senate, Cochran is in line to become the chairman of the powerful Senate Appropriations Committee. Cochran will continue probably to serve on the Senate Ag Committee, where he was the ranking Republican prior to the elections. The chairmanship of the Senate Ag Committee will pass from Michigan Democrat Debbie Stabenow to Republican Pat Roberts of Kansas. Roberts won a tough re-election race on Tuesday. Roberts brings a lot of ag legislative experience to the post. He served three terms on the Senate Agriculture Committee. Roberts has also served as chairman of the Agricultural Committee of the U.S. House of Representatives. Meanwhile, on the House side, Oklahoman Republican Frank Lucas will return as chairman of the Agriculture Committee.